Alhamdulillah Thumma salatu wa salamu ala ashrafil anbiyahi wal mursalin Wa ala ahlihi wa sahbihi ajma'in Amma bad Fassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Welcome everyone of us once again back to Madrasatul Majma Il Bahrain. We have made this video specifically for those in the intermediate class. And the goal of this video is to show you how to access the trainings and the videos that we have uploaded on the platform. Now, when you go to majmaulbahrain.com, this is what you see there, majmaulbahrain.com. So that's how you get to where I am. If you've done your enrollment yourself properly, so you would have actually been to this website before. So when you want to go for subsequent classes and you've properly enrolled, you will need to click on the student login. Now, if you've been logged out, it's going to give you the option to log in your information, your email and your password. So in my case, I'm actually logged in. So it's going to tell me I'm logged in. Let's see. So I've clicked on it. You see, it's saying you are already logged in. So if you are not logged in, it will give you the option to input your email and your password. So once you've confirmed that you're logged in, the next thing you should do is to come to dashboard. So once you click on dashboard, it's going to show you your courses so in this case the classes we are taking are the beginners and the intermediate class for me because i'm trying to explain i actually register enrolled for both classes but in your case you should actually enroll for only one of the two so if in your case it should be just the intermediate class that you would see you won't be seeing this beginners class since you didn't enroll for it well, in my case, the reason I'm seeing both the beginners and intermediate class is because I enrolled for both of them so that I'll be able to explain how the interface looks. So in your case, if you just see only the intermediate class, it's absolutely fine. So what you need to do is just double click on your intermediate class. So when you click on it, it's going to show you an interface like this. So it's going to show you an interface like this and once you see it what you need to do is click on the start learning button the start learning button so and we are going to do that now so i'll click on the start learning button so when you click on the start learning button the first thing you are going to see is the introductory video so this video i'm making is also going to be in the introductory video so thereafter you're going to also see the different subjects that we are doing just as i've explained in the previous video we are going to be doing six subjects so and all the six subjects are here tawhid fiqh quran hadith naho and so so each of those subjects we are just doing them once every week so because we are doing them just once every week it means that for the first week you would have your tawhid class and you, you would have it here However, when you, it's the next day, which is Tuesday, you would have to come to FIC and check week one for your FIC class. Do you understand? The same thing applies when it's Wednesday, you come to week one for Quran class and on and on and on. So for the Tawhid class, let's say we want to take our Tawhid class together. How do we now access it? All you need to do is click on that week one. Once you click on the week one, it's going to load the week one. To be sure that you're on the right place, if you look up here, you will see week one there. So it means that we're actually on week one. And once it's done loading, you will see that it has loaded the video here. However, I want you to note something. We are not going to be having all the videos ready because we are releasing them in as at when due. So it means that as at week one, you won't be able to see the videos for week two. And the same thing applies for as at week three, you won't be able to see the videos for week four. So it means that this week one is going to be available just in that first week. So when we are 
we are now in week two the week two will also be released and you'll be able to see both week one and also week two do you understand so you can see that this week two has zero zero and week three has zero zero and week four has zero zero the implication is that they have actually not been released however for week one you can see that's 30 minutes and 23 seconds so it means that it has been released and you can watch that video for that week so once you click on the play button either here or at the center here it's going to play the class so let's pause the class so once you are done watching all of the content for the class and you have taken your notes as you should do then you can click on mark as complete just click on mark as complete and when you click on mark as complete you will see that it's going to give it a tick you can see that's giving it a tick button so it has ticked the week one for you that you have actually done it so the same thing will apply for the next day subject the next day subject will be what thick so you go to thick on tuesday you do the same thing you click on it to take you to week one of thick you watch the class and when you are done watching the class you also mark it as complete so you continue in that manner on wednesday you go for quran week one on thursday hadith on friday nah and saturday south then the next monday which is week two you're now going to go to tawhid week two to continue and the same thing here too you are going to also come to fake week two on tuesday and on wednesday you come to fake week two that's the upper week and on and on and on and so you keep on taking the classes in that order so this is basically how to interact with the platform and how to use it so we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala makes it better understood than said and he forgives us our shortcomings and he makes this a source of good for us both in this world and the next. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.